Hi, I'm Shariar. In my previous video, I have shown how to create CSS3 hexagon. And today I'm gonna show you how to give some effects, how to make a hexagon with borders. Uh, I'm gonna show you the hexagon like this. Border and some cool effect like rotation or other things so let's start that was the previous code and today I will work only with the second way of hexagon I mean the hexagon with three rectangle so I do not need the first one I'm gonna delete this style and as well as the HTML. Right now I have only X2 with me. Let us see the preview. Only one. So in this uh, in this hexagon we used three rectangle. Let us see the inspected code here uh, before, after, and one was this one. So there is three. Since I'm talking that uh, I'm gonna create a hexagon with border, then we do not need the background color. Right now, we need border color. For example, red. Border color red. Reload. Nothing is shown because border. Uh, I have to set something else. White one pixel and border style solid. Let us see. You see our hexagon, but we do not we do not need this, huh? We just need this, 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 and this, not this other. So what we have to do is that we have to remove or hide this and this border this and this border and also this and this border that means for every triangle we only need left and right border of all the borders so what i should do is that border right zero pixel solid sorry transparent you see not left it should be top we can reload and as well as the bottom too right with border so what if we want to make the border little white so border white should be here for example 5 pixel you see there is a problem when the border is little white then the hexagon break in that case we have to adjust the position a little we are in inspection mode after and before here right left let us set a negative let me check in 1px the 
quite a bit. Let us add just no decrease. Now it is in perfect shape, right? So uh, when when you set a border white, then you may need to adjust the border. I mean white and also the positioning because a border has itself some white and uh, it's break the shape so we have to add just or we need to add just to make a right hexagon so let's copy this we set hexagon to after and before left minus 4 pixel here it is minus 4 pixel and we also have sensed the white right so what was the white? The white was here it is. Copy this and we will set this here. So right now we have a hexagon with border and the border is little white. If anyone think that he needs a little bit more white border, then he can adjust himself. For example, here is border white if we set it to 10 then I need to add just the position of after and before sorry I have to select first after I am in Google Chrome browser right now okay decrease and 10 is quite okay think water white and left is same mm -hmm. and we need to decrease the white so this is our hexagon reload previous one okay now I gonna give some hover effect for example when I'll hover on this then I will see the fill color okay so I add all these three as a selector and then I need to add hover on x2 x2 after and x2 before and what Add a background red reload and I hover red. You see, we already added a hover effect. Let us give some transition on it. Transition all 0.25 second and is. Save and reload. Do you see the sense? Nice now. But there is a problem. When I hover in, the effect is quite nice. But when I hover out, the effect is not good. So what I, what I have to do? Maximum people do this mistake that uh, they add transition in a hover the thing is that we have to add this in the raw section I mean here and now if I reload you see hover in effect hover out effect hover in effect hover out effect Let us choose a nice color. Go to flat flat UI color. I'm sorry. Flat UI color, then pick a nice color. For example, I'm gonna choose this, copy it, and then I will set this color where here and as well as border 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 here border color now if we reload we have the hexagon with nice if 
perfect. So what if you want to rotate the hexagon? Or maybe uh, in default with fill and on hover only the border. If so, then we have to alter something. But first we have to keep the background color here. Now I am trying to do that when no hover then this effect but when I will hover then only border. So what I have done I just change the background color or set the background color in the raw and I will set the background color transparent and I will hover on it. It's very simple now. It's really very simple. And make a reload. You see? The reverse. So now I'm gonna rotate. When I will hover, this will rotate. Then you know rotate comes from transform CSST transform transform rotate for example we're gonna rotate it 90 degree and reload the effect is not as expected it's something different so what we have to do right now we have to set a container before this hex hex container I'm gonna set this here and I'm gonna style this to Display inline block reload. Everything is fine now. And we have code inspector. Let us see something. Background red. Where it is. And transform. Rotate. It is degree. It's rotating, right? You see, everything is working fine. We have to rotate the parent container of the hexagon. That's where we can rotate the whole hexagon. So we have set hexagon container as display land block, and we're gonna set. Oh, no, this is fine. We have to set this. But when on hex there should be an I, right? Okay, I will mistake. in hexagon container we also have to set the hexagon container with some transition now reload you see is that cool and sense from 52 
expected. Vacating hover effect also rotation and some other effect. So thank you guys. Keep watching.